Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Microsoft is rolling out a nice change for the Microsoft Store Online. So if we just quickly head to the Microsoft Store for the web, Microsoft is introducing a new feature that now lets you create one-click install packs for multiple apps at once, which is very similar to what we get with the Nanot app and the Nanot website. And the process, as you may well know, makes downloading and installing multiple apps a lot easier. Now, here you'll see, if you visit the Microsoft Store online for desktop on your browser, you'll see a new multi-app install toggle here to the top right. And if we click on that, we've got a couple of different categories, productivity, creativity, social, entertainment, tools and utilities, personalization. So you've got a couple of options. So from here, you can select the apps you want to install in the different categories. So as an example, for entertainment, we can go Spotify, iTunes, Netflix. And then here you'll see to the right hand side, you then click on install selected. And then what will happen then is it'll download a .exe file to your local drive that you can then run on your PC to install all the apps at once, which I think is very handy. And then once that's downloaded, you run the installer and the Microsoft Store opens and begins downloading all the apps you've selected. So I think this is a very handy feature, very similar to what we get as mentioned with Nanot. At this stage though, there is a little bit of a catch because it seems that the multi-app install packages are only supported by the apps that appear on this page. So you only, at this stage, you are limited to what appears in these different categories on this page in the Microsoft Store online. And at this stage, and currently there are approximately 48 of the most popular apps according to Microsoft that are fit that are placed into these different categories. So nonetheless, just making you aware of that, I think that's a very handy feature and I hope that does come to the actual Microsoft Store for Windows 10 and Windows 11. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.